a little rush, but it's a compliment to you. Well, well, Mr. Patrick McLean, what a charming, urbane gentleman are you. And looking down from your four and a half litre Bentley, <laughs> which never broke down because you wound it up with the key. <laughs> and of course, remember it was tax free. <laughs> well, well, Mr. Patrick McNee, what a good looking fellow was he. And all the dames, damsels in distress would agree, who never did happen waver when Mrs. Peel was a quaver, and he flashed his sword stick uh, from his trusty umbrella before um, breakfast and comments for tea. <laughs> oh dear, dear Patrick McNee. Yes, here and there, but really never anywhere, and certainly never past the gates of ABC Elstree. <laughs> dear, dear Mr. Patrick McNee, your feet still are much and interestingly seen and gentlemanly please. Uh, we miss your incredible feats done with such immaculate taste uh, even when you didn't bother to do them yourself <laughs> and your double did the taste. <coughs> dear, dear Patrick McLean, uh, such a friend you were to all those actors who gave the, the baddie to me. Um, I, did a, I did a 12 of them, I remember. We thank you and you, Mrs. Peel, for the infinite joy we still feel when you vanquished our dastardly foe.